I'd have all you good-looking women fishing after me. That was Muddy Waters' Rolling Stone, which was his version of Catfish Blues, an extremely popular blues song and actually got recorded in some other genres as well. It is a fantastic song because it wraps up so many different techniques into one song. We've got the riff that we're going to be picking. We've got some different strum techniques that we're going to be doing, which you can find in John Lee Hooker's playing, you can find in Charlie Patton's playing, as well as a host of others. So really, this one song is going to give you the skill to be able to play so many different styles. And it is in standard tuning. Here's my low E. So match your low E with mine, tune the rest of the way. Again, standard tuning and we'll be able to work through this song. So the kicker to this song is this little bass run. We're gonna be at our G note, so our third fret sixth string to our E note on that fourth string, second fret, fourth string. That's it, bum, bum. And then just to kind of take the mojo out of the riff and just pare it down as to what we're gonna be doing, it's going to be a bend up on that third string, second fret, back down, open, back to that fourth string, second fret. Now I've got an unwound third on, on my guitar here. It's an 18 gauge plain steel. That's just something that I personally prefer, uh, not just for this song, but just for the style. And really I just kind of use it as uh, 
for any style on all of my guitars nowadays. If you do not have an unwound third, just something to consider. My middle finger, which I'm using to use my bend, is not necessarily the strongest to do that bend. What I will do in that case is I'll have my finger on the fret that I'm going to be bending. I will also place my finger, in this case, my first finger, index finger, behind it and, and aid in that pushing, pushing up. And if you have a wound third string on, that's, I think, going to help you get that bend that you're going to need for this. So again, we've got... And again, that's just a straight version of this. A few different things you can do. Bend, just pluck this once, bend up, down, then pluck again back to that E note. Or you can go and do a pull off back to that. So we've got. But now the real version is that. So this is what you're after. And the way we're going to get there. So what I'm doing is going a fast, a fast bend up, back down, pull off, and then to the note. So this is all one motion. One pluck, bend up, down, pull off, then the fourth string, second fret, that E note. That might take you a little bit to get used to doing that. The other thing you can do with this, to juice it up in my opinion, is add that first string, that high E, as a in with that pinch. So we've got. Now you can notice, I'm giving myself an open E, then I'm doing the bass, then I'm doing a thumb down. Then the bend. This is all just added coloring. This stuff is just rhythmic coloring that I'm adding in. And you can hear him do his own version of that. Everybody kind of has their own version of that. Yours is going to be different than mine. Mine's obviously different than Muddy's. And it's just what I'm thinking of is keeping this time, the one. Two, three, four. So I know I want to keep that time, but I also want to do the bass and the lick. So I'm keeping time. Okay, there we go. Will I wish? So our strum, this is a John Lee Hooker strum. It's an up, down down. I'm going to show you two things. One, I'm cutting out the strings with my remaining open fingers here. So up, down, and as soon as I go down, I'm cutting out the strings. Another thing that you're going to want to do is on that upstroke, do a hammer on. You hear how that changes it? So we're going to go. Well, I wish I was a catfish swimming along deep blue sea. So here, now what we're going to do is just keep time with that sixth string. And then it's a one, two, one, two, one, two, which is a shuffle rhythm on that G note of the first string. So third fret, first string. So we've got, well, I wish I was a catfish swimming in love, the deep blue sea, another bass. I'd have all you good-looking women fishing after me. 
so now what we've done is we've changed from doing the the band to the bass in between the strum fishing after me fishing after me still keeping that up down rhythm fishing after me now we got this tricky element again just stripping out the mojo of it we've got this so it's like a hammer on bass up down and then this bend and the bend I'm using my thumb for the bend up and then I'm going up down back to my E That's the entire song as far as the verse is concerned. We've got this instrumental break that we're going to be doing. So we got this. One, two, three, four. Just keeping that time. Two, three, four. We got this rhythm. times one two and on the third that's how you're getting back to your E so on the third time do a hammer on on that third fret of that second string and to our E chord and then we're gonna go so it's third fret third string Walking down, 3rd fret, 2nd fret on that 3rd string, open, back to our E. E7, now B7, walk up from our 1st fret into our B7. Now we're going to go slide to your 4th fret on that 6th string, open A, then A again to kick off our, which is just first fret, second fret on that fourth string. We're gonna do the same thing on the fifth string. Okay, what you wanna do is arrive. You wanna get this G note, third fret, sixth string, and you wanna get back to your E note on that fourth string of that second fret. So however you wanna do it, totally fine. It's fair game. Again, you just want to arrive back there. Now we're going to end by going, take your A chord, slide it up to the 7th fret, which is D, walk it up, D sharp, E, and then, and then you want that first string that E note again, that high E at the 12th fret. So it goes. And then low E for that bass. And that's the ending. That's the whole song, Rolling Stone. Let's go to the split screen. I'm going to slow it down, play it verse by verse with that instrumental break. This is where the tablature is going to come from for this song. So here it is, the slowed version of Rolling Stone. Fishing after me, fishing after me. 
after me Fishing after me Oh yes I house and I sat on down her steps she said now come on in now muddy my husband just now left my husband just now left my husband just now left oh yes Just before I was born, you're gonna have a boy child coming, gonna be a rolling stone, gonna be a rolling stone, gonna be a rolling stone. I feel like my low down time ain't long. Well, I'm gonna catch that first train smoking down the road. I'm gone down the road. I'm gone down the road. I'm gone.